hello my dear friends welcome to my channel in this video i am going to share multiple choice question of assessment for learning as this subject is bit difficult as compared to other subject so this subject need more practice so in this video i am going to share 15 multiple choice questions but in my next video i will try to cover मोर देन ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन और मोर देन थर्टी क्वेश्चन सो अगर आपने सब्सक्राइब नहीं किया है तो अभी सब्सक्राइब करिए टू गेट द रिसेंट मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन ऑफ असेसमेंट फॉर लर्निंग सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द वेरी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन दैट इज सिलेबस इज अ पार्ट ऑफ फर्स्ट वट इज अलेबस सिलेबस इज अ डॉक्यूमेंट राइट दैट कंटेन ऑल द पोर्शन ऑफ कंसेप्ट कवर्ड इन अ सब्जेक्ट ठीक है जो हमें एक पूरे सब्जेक्ट में जो भी बच्चों को करवाना है दैट इज़ अ सिलेबस राइट एंड व्हाट इज़ करिकुलम करिकुलम इज़ अ ओवरऑल कंटेंट दैट इज़ टॉट इन एजुकेशनल सिस्टम एंड इट इंक्लूड एवरीथिंग ऑल द टीचिंग मेथड टीचिंग मटेरियल टेक्स्ट बुक्स सिलेबस राइट एवरीथिंग इज देयर इन अ करिकुलम देयर फोर सिलेबस इज ऑल्सो अ पार्ट ऑफ करिकुलम सो ऑप्शन डी इज करेक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर टू द वर्ड पैडागॉजी मीन्स टू लीड द चाइल्ड ओके पैडागॉजी एक्चुअली इट इज़ अ मैथड ऑफ टीचिंग और प्रैक्टिस ऑफ टीचिंग विच इम्प्रूव द क्वालिटी ऑफ टीचिंग एज वेल एज इट इम्प्रूव द क्वालिटी ऑफ लर्निंग ऑल्सो सो इट इज़ अ माइंडफुल वे ऑफ टीचिंग विच कैन हेल्प द स्टूडेंट टू बिकम अ डीप लर्नर और वी कैन से टू लीड द चिल्ड्रेन वी हेल्प द स्टूडेंट to lead right therefore option d is correct question number 3 pedagogy is a study of yes it is a teaching method option c is correct question number 4 the philosopher who worked in mathematical and scientific did actus was option c martin no uh scientific didactics means uh it means uh giving the instruction in a moral way right so this was uh, proposed by the martin option c question number 5 the use of technology to enhance learning process is called ict in education so option b is correct question number 6 a scoring guide used to evaluate the quality of student is called rubrics it is a definition of rubrics a scoring guide used to evaluate the quality of student is called rubrics so option a is correct so it's a direct question question number 7 in education dash is used to make inference about the learning and development of students that is assessment right so option a is correct question number 8 an assessment that is conductor prior to the start of teaching or instruction is called it is called initial assessment okay so initial assessment means uh, uh, that assessment that is required before starting before the start of teaching so initial itself means to start right so it is a direct question initial assessment so option e is correct question number 9 an assessment that is carried out through the course is called it is called formative assessment so formative assessment is a kind of feedback like taking the feedback from the students how much student have learned so it can be conducted during the class okay so formative assessment option c is correct an assessment is dash 
if it consistently achieve the same result with the same students that is a reliable uh, assessment is reliable if it consistently achieve the same result reliable means trusted so option c is correct question number 11 and dash assessment is one which measures that is intended to measure so here option a is correct question number 12 it has been proven that teacher always ask content questions which does not refer to the content questions that is closed questions so what type of closed questions are the question yes no me puch jaye that is the closed questions or there's a multiple choice questions and that are called closed question so okay so क्वेश्चन था विच इज नॉट रेफर टू अ कंटेंट क्वेश्चन ठीक है तो ऑप्शन ए इज करेक्ट क्लोज क्वेश्चन आर नॉ नॉट रेफर्स टू कंटेंट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन क्विज इज टू फॉर्मेटिव टेस्ट वाइल प्रियोडिक इज टू सर्मेटिव टेस्ट ऑप्शन बी बिकॉज क्विज that can be done during the class during the lecture right or periodic test jo hote hain aur jisko hum bolte hain mid term test ho gaye that falls under the category of summative tests right so option b is correct question number 14 in mastery learning the definition of an acceptable standard of performance is called an criterion measures so it is a direct definition so option b is correct question number 15 in the last question also which measure the central tendency separates the top half of group from the bottom half so option d is totally incorrect because what is mode mode mein hum kya karte hain जो मोस्ट कॉमन नंबर हो उसको हम पिक करते हैं दैट इज कॉल्ड मोड राइट सो ये ऑप्शन गलत है क्वेश्चन इज विच मेजर मेजर्स द सेंट्रल टेंडेंसी सेपरेट द टॉप हाफ ऑफ द ग्रुप फ्रॉम द बॉटम हाफ सो इट कैन बी मीडियन एज वेल एज मेन सो ऑप्शन सी इज करेक्ट वट इज मीडियन इन वट इज मेन मेन इज लाइक टेकिंग द एवरेज right right so median median is taking the middle numbers right so that is called median so option c is correct both it can be both median as well as mean so option c is correct so in my next video i am going to share more multiple choice question of assessment for learning okay if you have not subscribed subscribe my channel so so that you can get the recent updates and all the very best for your exams thank you so much for watching my video